One of the best ideas I, I used or developed was was to take the um, the blue scale or the, or the pentatonic. <laughs> C sharp there. You know that you know the scale shape. They call them boxes. So box one. Um, and I found that for most for the most part, most most of the time, you tend to stick to the top half of the uh, other than box one, if we if we take this from from the fifth fifth position, or a a pentatonic or a blues, a minor pentatonic, I should say. I've found that the the, the, the as a rule, you'll use this box one. get sick of it so over time what, what happened was I, I, I thought well I need to learn each box with each mode of the pentatonic scale using that same approach When, when I was actually playing I would use generally the top half of, of, of each box so if we started on the um, let's take let's take a tempo See how I tend to stay in the top half of each box. So I'll do something similar and I'll talk, I'll talk you through it. So we're on box one. Now I'm on box two. Slide up to box three. Box four. Five. Box one again. So it's worth learning each box. Box one. Box two. So box two starts on the, the second fret of box one. Five eight is box one. Five, five eight five seven five seven five seven five eight five eight. Everyone knows that. Box two. Um, so we start on the on the eight this time. Eight ten, nine ten, nine ten, nine. Sorry, seven nine. I'll do that again. Eight ten, seven ten, seven ten, seven nine. Eight ten, eight ten. So the next box starts on on the second note of box two. So we go to the tenth fret. And we play 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 12, 9, 12, 10, 13, 10, 12. So the next box starts on the E on the 12th fret. So now we've got um, 12, 15, 12, 15, 12, 14, 12, 14, 13, 15, 13, 15. Then the last, the last box. We start on the G on the 15th fret of the E. So we go 15, 17, 15, 17, 14, 17, 14, 17, 15, 17, 15, 17. There's one, there's one other thing before I finish this video. If you, if you take the, um, the box one shape, start on the first four notes. If it's the blues, it'll be this. That, that shape is really... Um, Conducive to, to moving around the neck. So if I if I start on the if I play the A blues, just use 
those first. If it's the pentatonic, it's the first four notes. If it's the blues, the first five notes. And I can link each each octave with that note. So. So what I've done is I've taken the um, that first five notes. If I take it from the top, 12, 11, 10, 13 on the B, 10 on the on the on the B, and link link the two boxes with with the 12th on the G. So I just played the same thing an octave lower. So that the E there down to the D, C A G. Well, I can take the G there. Or I can take the G there, so there's, it's on the eighth on the B, twelfth on the G, and then just do the same thing, an octave lower. G string nine, eight, seven. D string ten, seven. And there's my G on the on the tenth of the A, and then I'll do the same octave, same thing, an octave lower. Sorry. There's the G. Handy little lift to off. Um, so rather than thinking um, box, I'm thinking across, which feels a little bit less cumbersome than it. this this blue scale or, or minor pentatonic. I find quite difficult to to get expression from just playing it there. Sounds like everything any, everyone else has ever done. <laughs> Develop your ability to express yourself.